Good morning from day 14. We're at the end of the second week. Uh, just got to do a few things today, really. Take some more rubbish out. You know who you are. It's going to be a different bin. We haven't found it yet, but... But, look, you can see here, it's like... This is the... We've got, like, a double door. It's kind of, this door kind of reminds me of, like, an old... An old pub, an old English pub door, you know, that would something that would connect the snug from the saloon. I think all the, only the people my age would understand that. But yeah, that's what it is. I'm going to just check on the car. We've got Victoria walking ahead. Where are you going, Victoria? The car's that way. Yeah, yeah, so we're going to go just go on and check on the car. I think it's in a bit of a mess, to be honest. Um, other than that, we've got to go to the bank again. Because, whoa, nearly got run over then by that car. We've got to go to the bank again because... The problem is with our insurance on the car, we had a meeting. So the war started on the 24th of February and we were, we'd already booked a meeting. For, I think it was the 26th, it was a, no, 20, 25th, it was a Friday we booked a meeting because we needed to pay our insurance on the car. We've had it a year now. Now, unfortunately, war started and we didn't manage to get it. So we kind of got no insurance at the moment and we've got to try and sort that out before we get across the border, I think. Our car's there, darling. No, it's that one there. Okay. That, that very, very dirty car there. Uh. Okay, so um, we've got to sort the insurance out. That's why we're going to the bank. Not really worried. The, the car's not insured in a war situation anyway. The bank have told us that. But we might need it to cross the border. So that's the reason we're here in Lviv for a couple of days. Obviously, it's, um, it's a beautiful city as well, so it's not a big problem. But we're just trying to sort the, the car out at the moment. We've got all the stuff out. We don't really know what's in here anymore. What are you looking for, Victoria? Veronica. What? Tell me. Veronica needs her bottle. Okay. I'm and not... I want to clean here. Look, we're a mess. Well, we're only going to fill it up again. You know, uh... We're gonna fill it up again and mess it up. So I think the, the phrase flogging a dead horse comes to mind. But, you know, Victoria is Victoria and she likes to do her cleaning. No, Victoria doesn't like cleaning. No, she does. She's very good at it as well. I like, I like to arrange things, but not clean. She likes to arrange things. She, uh, she's like a fixer, you know? She likes to arrange things. So, What's everything okay? Bank? We can go to the bank. We've even got a chopping board in here. I mean, what were we expecting? To pull the grill out on the side of the motorway and have a barbecue or something? Um, we could have. We could have done that. We were stuck in queues for so long. But um, we've got more rubbish. In. Look at the state of Victoria's side. Look. Have a look. Before she clears it up, <laughs> look at all this mess. It's like a plumber's work van in here. It's disgraceful. No one, you wouldn't have thought this a car's only a year old, would you? It's the state of it. But anyway, um, let's get to the bank and see what they say, okay? Can you hold 